Before showing you a very interesting table, once in the Torah you can see in the middle in black, a Dom and Ishmael, a Dom and Ishmael from the bottom to the up. Let us see what is written in the name of the Vilna Gaon, based on the Kabbalah and the Zohar, about the Erev Rav. The bats were seen in the land. This is really a very thin song of song, which indicates to the end of time. So what will be then? The general role of the two messiahs, Messiah son of Joseph and Messiah son of David, together in all generation is protection and war against the three evil forces, Edom, Ishmael, and Erebrav. Erebrav are mainly Jews who are against the Torah, like in Israel, governments left it. The special role of Messiah, son of Joseph, against Isu, or against Edom, they left Ask. The Ask is a term of evil force, and his special role of the Messiah, son of David, against Ishmael, and both of them together against Adam and Ishmael, who are an uncle in ox and donkey, when they come to the Kabbalah, the Medrash, Isu, Adam compared to ox, and Arab, Ishmael to donkey. The mating of Isu, Adam, and Ishmael is by the ruler of the Arab world, and can destroy Israel and the whole world. So this is a idea which is taken from the book Kolator chapter 2. One can see there much more material, but I took the main part because this is exactly what we are going to see now in this table. So, as I said, unbelievable phenomena to have such many letters, Adam and Ishmael, and you can see Adam and Ishmael comes here together. Then you have next to it mixed multitude in purple, definitely these are the Arab Rav. Then you have sons of Joseph in green, Elijah will come with Messiah, it is known. And then, interesting the date which comes here is Metaphin Pegimal from 5783, 2022, interesting. Now, who is Adam really that we see Adam and Esau in the end of time? So, this is the state when those were against Israel. Like, like today, you see, clearly they said that Israel is allowed to expand. Here, yeah, no settlements and uh, to give up to the Palestinians, which is even against the Torah, because the Torah says that. <laughs> The land of Israel belonged to them, God gave it to them. So here you have the state and Biden in black, and Philistines and United States, and together, all of them come together, because this is really exactly what the Zohar says, the Kabbalah says, the Vilna Gaon, this is Adam, the forces which go together with Ishmael. You see, together with Ishmael and the Philistines, basically the same idea. So very, very interesting idea. As I see here in the picture, really so clear, you see the left, right? Right down the left, because those are the left to support definitely <laughs> the Palestinian Ishmael. And you have right in the center Messiah, because Messiah will come definitely after such situations. The Zohar said clearly that before the Messiah, the Erev Rav, Mixed multitude will be ruling in Israel. This was really the government of Lapid, Meretz, Lieberman against the Torah. Yeah, so Baruch Hashem, we got rid of them. Now we are very close to the Messiah. But this is what is written that, that these people, we know Lapid and Torah, they try to build up strong connection with Biden, yeah, the Palestinians, definitely a <laughs> great danger to Israel because they say clearly. They want to destroy Israel, you know. It's such a strange phenomenon that the Lapid and, and uh, Lieberman, together with Balad, with the worst Arab people who would say clearly they want to exterminate Jews, Israel. So, frightening situation, but this is exactly what is written in the Kabbalah, as we saw. So, this is what you see in the table. 
at Domin Ishmael, coming together, situation like to get Uden Ishmael, you know, Uden Ishmael, today is a mistake, you see, which are very strongly against Israel now. Biden, not like it was in the time <laughs> with uh, Donald Trump, you know, they are already threatening Israel, you should not have been weary, you should not have stormed it, because Right, they are afraid that Israel will try to expand to build more settlement. So, that means it's against the Torah. He's Arab Rab, together with him, he's Arab Rab. The Arab Rab, the leftists in Israel agree with them. They said also that Israel are conquerors. That means because you don't believe in the Torah. This was the situation. So, look properly, really, in this table. It's really unbelievable to have this phenomenon once in the Torah, the Dominic Shmuel in black. Then in your purple Erev Rav, mixed multitude, which is exactly the Israelis, the leftists, which are joining this combination meeting. And then you have on the green sons of Joseph, Elijah, will come definitely against these forces. And you have in purple on the left side, Bet Yaakov, House of Jacob, is written that very famous verse from the Bible that that in future the house of Joseph, the house of Jacob will be fire, and the house of Joseph flame will be leava, which is really flame of fire. So together will destroy those evil forces of the Arab Rav and Adam Ishmael against Israel and Messiah will come. So you can see in the center, Messiah comes parallel to Adam and Ishmael. Then on the left side you have in blue, the Palestinians, and in bl black, Biden, and uh, United States, in red. You have in yellow, we didn't translate it, but in yellow, you have a promise, God will remember you and will redeem you, and this open that will be soon. So, as I said, very interesting part of the book, Kolator, you can get it in English, you can read it also in the internet, I think even then, no money. Then, yeah, if you put collator, and then you can see and read much more about this idea of son of Joseph and son of David and the Erev Rav, mixed multitude. But I gave you the main idea here because it fits with a table, because the table you can see a Domin Ishmael, which is mentioned there, and you can see the mixed Mark Erev Rav who joined them together, yeah. Then you see the power of the left, yeah, definitely. Which everything is mentioned there, and all of this definitely will be before the conversation. And we hope, as we are now really after sabbatical year, which is 5783, about, about what is written there. Very places, in many places, is written that on this, after the sabbatical, Messiah will come. And about Chaim Kalevsi, the third promise that will come. So these are the year now, but what we have to do, we have to do Shiva to repent, to give the Shabbat, to give the Torah, which is the basis of having Messiah. Yeah, I did not bring it, but you have here the verse, the Shiva, the Shuv, you should return, at Asher Tashuv, that only this Messiah will have and he will return, but who knows what will bring the. Jews to return, to repent, as uh, my mother says, if Jews will not do it willingly, so uh, God probably it will be, but who knows, because of which kind of threat we run, and now you see what is going in the world. So interesting and significant, relevant table to our time.